just before one o'clock this afternoon, silence fell over Ferrybank as the funeral cortege carrying the remains of Craig Breen arrived at the Church of the Sacred Heart. The darkness came so suddenly and it became so widespread so quickly, enveloping not just yourselves but so many friends and fans and people who had followed Craig's endeavours and achievements for so many years. Since the hugely popular driver lost his life while preparing for the second rally of the season last week, memories have come flooding back for as many friends as well as his family. Craig was the cutest child, placid, easygoing. All he wanted day in, day out was to play with something that had wheels. His school yearbook send off quote was that he wanted to make people proud. But Craig, yeah, I can safely say, mission accomplished. <laughs> and the world of motorsport has been united in grief. Because what you saw on the television, or if you're lucky enough to know him personally, was what you got. He was as genuine as they came. It's been an absolute privilege, and it's so hard as a broadcast journalist in rallying not to have favourites. But when Craig Breen was on the stage, my heart always fell for him. And I think he knew that. I hope he knew that. He was an incredible gentleman actually um he was an imp incredible person and he obviously as we all know had incredible talent at the end tears but also tributes for a young man who lived his dream connor kane rt news ferrybank in waterford